Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell from the title of this video, this is going to be a pay collaboration. But I am really grateful that you clicked on this video to give it a watch because I honestly think that you are going to love this. Now in my line of work, I get to review a few things and this has to be one of my most favourites so far. And this is called a tony box and we've been reviewing this for the past few weeks and this is just a little review so if you want to like find out what on earth this little cube is then keep watching so first up what is a tony box what on earth is this little cube with what looks like ears well it's essentially a new digital audio system for kids i have three children i've got bill who is six I've got Daisy who's nearly three and I've got Stanley who has just turned one. So that's who I've been reviewing this in mind with and trying it out with. And what you can do with the Tony Box is that you can listen to music, you can listen to pre-recorded audio content of which you can buy and you can also record your own and keep it to listen with your children as well. So this is the Tony Box itself. It comes in a range of different colours. We went for the lime green because just thought it looked quite nice and I like the look of it and there is red to choose from there's blue go and have a look and see which one like suits your child because there's loads of different variations and what you essentially do is that you use your Tony box with these little guys now I'll just pop this down a second and I will show you what they are now these are all called Tonys and they are they all have different functions basically so I was asked to choose a couple to go alongside my Tony box this one came with it and this is a creative Tony which I will get into more in a little bit and then these two along with many others you can select and they will tell your children pre-recorded content so story tales for example and that kind of thing which is what this one does this is the little red riding hood story tales one it tells tales of you know things that you'll remember as a kid including little red riding hood sleeping beauty and so on and so forth there's a few of these so you can collect them and teach your kids all of the fairy tales if you want to and then i also chose this little guy which is a how and why dinosaur one because if you followed me for any length of time, my eldest absolutely loves dinosaurs and I thought that this would be an extra way to feed his curiosity on the subject. So what's included with the Tony box and how easy is it to set up and that kind of thing because that's the sort of thing that matters to me as a mum because I don't really enjoy unpackaging stuff and trying to work out how to use it and whether or not I need batteries and things like that. Now the first thing that you'll be really pleased to know is that this comes with its own charging port. So you can use it whilst it's on the charging port but if you've left it to charge for a, a certain amount of time you can take it off and carry it around with you, use it through different parts of the house and things like that and it's just really really convenient so you don't need to worry about batteries you just need to keep it charged regularly now along with this you also get your instructions this didn't take me very much time at all it sets up via your wi-fi it's so so easy to use and it took me about five minutes i just had to set it up via my computer and then i was good to go and then along with that you also get your creative tony which for me is my favorite part about the tony box as much as i love the other tonys which i think are fantastic and my kids have absolutely loved using them this for me is really really special now what you can do with this creative tony and other tonys that you can buy online at the tony store is that you can get creative as the name suggests now if you think about us as humans one of the biggest things that's lasted through time is storytelling and I miss that. We're all online these days. Like obviously there are other forms of entertainment such as television and books and things like that. But storytelling is how we pass on culture. It's how we pass on memories and that kind of thing. And this really reintroduces it to children I think. So what you can do is you can record or add any content that you want to, audio content that is, to this little guy and play it through your Tony box. So for example, what if you have a special story that your mum used to tell you and now she can tell it to her grandchildren forevermore? What if you have a partner that works away a lot and the kids miss him or her? You can record a bedtime story from them so every night they can put this special little guy on their Tony box and think of their parent who they miss. The opportunities are endless. You can make up little songs together and record them so the kids can play them back to themselves and have a giggle. All I've actually been using is the microphone function on my phone. It's been really, really easy to do and the quality is amazing. Once upon a time in a land far, far away lived a little boy 
called Belle, a little girl called Daisy, she and a little baby called Stanley. And this is their story. I just think that this little guy harnesses so much power of keeping like your family memories alive. And I just think it's absolutely beautiful. I think it's a really, really lovely idea. Now, in terms of functionality and how suitable this is for kids, I think it's absolutely fantastic. As you can see, it's very squishy and padded. So everything is nicely protected. The kids can roll it around the floor. It's not gonna get damaged. Stanley, my one-year-old, has even had a play with this and a listen, he absolutely loves it. And I think it's a great way to encourage like different words and expand your children's vocabulary as well. You can tilt it either side if you want to fast forward or rewind and the kids pick this up really really quickly which is a really nice physical way of doing it without having to teach them about certain buttons or what to press and what to do and then you see these two bits here which Daisy likes to call ears they turn the volume up and down as well so it's so easy for a child to use and then obviously if you want to start it you just simply put your Tony of choice on the top here and it's magnetic so it stays in place and then you are good to go. Another thing I love about our Tony box is that you can actually bring it out and about with you in the car maybe even a restaurant if you keep the volume down low and it's not going to bother anyone and it's going to keep your kids entertained so all you need to do is make sure it's fully charged it's got a fantastic battery life and you can just take it on the go with you. It's as simple as that. One very important question would be though, do my kids enjoy it? Do they like it? Have they been using it a lot? What do they think of it? Now, when I got this out, they were so confused at first. They were like, mama, what is that? What is that? And asking me loads of questions, but they picked up how to use it really, really quickly. And the really nice thing is that I felt like it made lots of different content accessible to all three of them because they can all hear they can all listen one thing that has really really impressed me is that Daisy just gets so so excited she's picking up words that she knows she's making her own social links to those words about how she remembers certain things or how she relates to certain things and I've actually got a little clip that I'm going to include here just to show you how much she's been loving it because every single time we put it on she just gets so excited and so engaged with the story and I absolutely love it so here it is. Then he gave orders <gasps> that there should be a big piano world and he when... invited not only all his relatives yeah, friends, banging. but banging. also the fairies who lived that in the kingdom. Hit my ear. <laughs> he would give his daughter some nice gifts. There were 13 all together but as he only had 12 gold plates for them to eat from he had to leave one I don't know when it's so it was hungry. A wonderful thing. Yeah, they're hungry. The end, yes, the I'm running and gave their gifts to the child. Mama. Yeah. One gave her a kind heart. When the king's daughter is 15 years old. I want to be my mission has to be daughter. You are a daughter. Yeah. yeah. She couldn't undo the wicked fairy spell. I want to be a fairy. You want to be a fairy? Yeah. Oh, bring the fairy! I love to be fairy, Mama. Yeah. So it's safe to say that she's a fan anyway. And then in terms of Bill, what he's been loving is, especially because there's a dinosaur aspect there for him, so he's really enjoying that Tony at the moment. He is so hungry for knowledge and he's trying all avenues possible. So whether or not he's looking at like video content, he's reading books, he's trying to find out as much as he can. And this is a new aspect for him and it also keeps him like really chilled. I've noticed that when I put it on after school, he's just a lot calmer. And I also like the fact that it's taking them away from that traditional digital side where you know they're bombarded with loads of like noise and visual elements where they turn into zombies and they're distracted and they're not really focusing on the story they're kind of zoning out do you know what I mean so I have loved trying that with him I also thought that it could potentially benefit some children that may have sensory issues where certain things like cause them to feel a little bit overwhelmed or upset so it could be a different way of exploring stories if for example say books and certain textures make them feel uncomfortable so I just feel like it's got a lot of use but the main one for me is just bringing back storytelling to our family in a way that can last. So that is all for me in this review because I could cheer your ear off all day, I like it that much. But I do feel like if you are happy to buy your children other digital devices, then this is definitely one to look at as an alternative because I think it's absolutely fantastic and it really brings back the essence of telling children stories and teaching children things. And I've really, really enjoyed giving it a go. But yeah, thank you so 
much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Any details will be left in the description bar below. So if you would like to find out a little bit more about the Tony box, then you can do. But have a lovely day and thank you so much for watching and I will hopefully see you soon.